Hello everyone! Time for product of the day. It's another late night. I just like lose the time, trick of time. I don't know what happens. I don't know. I don't know what happens. I'm just gonna wait a few minutes and see if anyone wants to jump on to check out what we got going on. Hello, hello. So I'm going to do a product of the day every day. This is the third day. If you missed it, we did go over Scentsy Soak as well as the Scentsy Fresh, which are two of my favorite products. Hello, 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 everyone. How are we doing? All right, let me just see who's jumping on. Hey Sophie, hey Christina, yeah mom life, hey Judy, hey Diamond, Diamond, uh, you got your present for Lilo going in the mail tomorrow, so I'm going to send it to you guys. Hey Jessica, Jessica, I'll get back to your message as soon as I get off of here, um, but I'm going to just actually let you guys know, so I've been posting along with product of the day, I've also been posting um, daily um, quarantine specials, so if you guys would like to claim one, so how it works is every day I have a limited number, so the first day I did six packs of wax, so I had a couple different categories like Disney, Between the Sheets, It's Fall Y'all, Christmas, Spring christmas back and you know and and i had another one i can't remember i can't remember what it was off the top of my head but so once that one is claimed then you can't get it anymore because i only have one for enough for one of each box because this is stuff i actually have on hand so i don't have to wait for it to get shipped to me then ship it to you these this is everything i'm offering right now is all products i have so everything i have is in stock ready to be shipped um i was going to send some on saturday um but i didn't want them to be left today in the warehouse like just in case i don't like that so i'm going to send them all starting tomorrow so once once the box is claimed you can't get in anymore so i do have um one box left for the um six pack of wax hey richard um miss so it's a mystery so you don't know what's in it all of them are a mystery i'm trying to give you guys hints though um then the next day yesterday's was um color me happy unplugged so you don't have to use any type of plugs two versions there was two at 18 and two at 26 um and then all, today is a load of fun um so hint hint load so we have three boxes at 19 dollars and two at 12. so that is a little rundown of that so once they're gone they're gone so be sure to snag them up quick and i'm doing different ones every day um, for as long as I have the stuff, right? <laughs> okay, so let's get on to the product of the day. Like I said, if you missed it, we did already talk about Scentsy Soak, um, and we talked about the Scentsy Fresh, which I actually took back in my back out in my living room, so I don't have it in here anymore. So today, I want to talk to you guys about we have tons of warmers. Um, there are warmers for everyone. We have tons of, you know the little vessels that carry our fragrance so wonderfully um our warmers are used why i like them is three reasons mostly so number one is that they are so customizable there are so many different types of warmers and they're always coming out with new warmers specials warmer of the month all kinds of things um so you can find a warmer for you there is all different types of styles like right now we have like farmhouse styles we have um you know like we have this we have like moroccan ones we have positive ones we have like a bee one uh, we have dog ones um there's a couple different dog ones um so we have something for any decor um in here this is my scentsy room so it's anything scentsy um, but my personal space is lemons my kitchen is like lemons but my house is like farmhouse and my room is more like elegant so I have all different warmers all around and I have found a perfect one for each so um hey grandma Sophie says I want the 12 one please oh, oh okay Shh. okay I won't say anything <laughs> hey autumn okay sorry Judy I'm trying not to be too loud because my daughter is in the next room let me turn my volume up to and see if that helps i'll try to talk a little bit louder so sorry can you guys can is anybody else having some trouble hearing me let me know 
Okay, so anyways, back to our warmers. Um, the second thing, hey Zach, I like about our warmers is um, they're customizable, one, and two, they are very safe. Um, either our light bulb or our element warmers, because we have a couple different types. We have some that have a light bulb and some that just have a heating plate. They stay at a constant temperature. So that means you're saving money and you are creating a safety habit. If you go to another store and you look on the back of the box, normally you're going to see that um, you can't leave the warmers on for more than four hours at a time because it will overheat. And also, if you've ever noticed, your wax just disappears. That means your warmers are getting way too hot. I can stick my hand in a full glass of melted wax like full dish of melted wax and it will not burn i could spill it all over the place like all over me all over ashlyn all over Gemma, my dog and it would not burn them it doesn't because it stays at a constant temperature which means you're saving money because that means your scents are warming all at the same rate so you don't have it super high or super low you know all kinds of craziness so I'm gonna show you guys today one of my favorite warmers. The product of the day is the Make a Scene Warmer, which is on clearance. It is not in the catalog, so I'm not gonna show you the catalog today. Um, picture, you, I've been telling you like the page, you can find it on in the new catalog. It's not in the catalog, but it is on the clearance section. Um, okay, message me later, Sophie. So I'm gonna turn you guys around. So this is the Make a Scene Warmer, this one here. As you can see, there's a picture in it. This is me and um, Philip holding a picture of Ashlyn and a sonogram. This is one of my maternity pictures. Thanks, Serlina, if you're watching. If you guys don't know Serlina and you live close to the Apopka, Orlando area, you guys need to get your pictures done from her because she's awesome. Side note. <laughs> so this does have a pretty bright light as you can see but this is considered an element warmer as you can see there's no light bulb in it that's warming the wax there, there's a dish right here so this is where the wax would go in this dish I do have some like remnant wax I need to clean out <clears throat> um, but you see here oh, let me just take it off because I don't want to break it ah. Don't touch, don't touch the plate because it is hot. So this is the warming plate. So instead of using a light bulb, it just uses this plate to warm the wax up. But it still is safe. It still keeps it as a, at a constant temperature. And I kind of like the element warmers better because there's no light bulb to change. Um, if you notice in our other ones, the light bulb, you have to change it. Hey Janice, hey Maddie, thank you for joining. So I'm just going over the product of the day, which is this warmer here. This is one of my favorite warmers. And as you can see, there's a picture in it. Like I said, you can put anything you want in here. I, this I kind of like dedicated to Ashlyn. I want to find a different picture, uh, but this is just what I have right now. And I have the hospital band from when she was born, um, you know, all of our information on it. So that's super cute, but you can take take this out and put anything you want in here. It is, I'm trying to like decipher like height wise, how tall it is. I should have probably took a measurement. It's not that tall. So it's less than six inches tall because this picture here is a four by six and it's turned like, like this way. You know, it's like turned like this. So it doesn't fit. Um, if it was turned like this, I think it would be better. But this, it's, so it's like less than six inches height. I'll, I'll measure it and tell you guys the exact measurement. Um, the special thing about element warmers and the reason why they kind of created element warmers was because as you can see all of our warmers with light bulbs like these two are both light bulb warmers. They give off a ton of light. This one does too but most of the other element warmers they don't have any type of light. So because they are just warming the wax from the top plate they don't need any type of light. Um, so it's perfect for like your bedroom for at night when you want to go to sleep and maybe the light bothers you but you still want that burst of fragrance oh you look how cute you guys are so cute judy and maddie hi mom hi judy or hi maddie that's so cute you guys are adorable so anyways you can put a whole bunch of stuff you can kind of see i have the sharpie here it's not as tall as a sharpie and you gotta like take a little bit for the account of this 
little seal here, but you can put a whole bunch of stuff. I'm actually gonna post some pictures of some scenes that you can uh, make with it. So make sure that you guys take a look at the pictures that I post because it is a super cute warmer and it is on clearance right now for $27, you guys. So it is super cheap, super affordable, super cute. You can put all kinds of things in here. So I definitely wanted to show you guys this one because it is literally one of my favorites. So you can change it with the season, like Easter's coming up, you could put little Easter eggs in there for Christmas. You could put little Christmas trees and fake snow. For Halloween, you could put like pumpkins in there or maybe a figure of Jack Skellington or maybe a little truck with some pumpkins in the back, I'm not sure. You know what, I'm sure you guys could create all kinds of awesome things to go in it. So that is my product for the day. So the Element Warmer, the Make a Scene is what it's called. It is on clearance for $27 is the best. I, I, I love this warmer. It is like my favorite because you can do anything you want with it. I, and I love it. This, and oh, let me go back to it. So this light here, you know, like I was saying, most element warmers don't have a light, but this light here is to illuminate whatever you have in the jar. Um, because let me just show you what it looks like without the light. Oh, let me see, I gotta find the right cord. I think that's the right one. Okay, right. So see, it's kind of like dull. You can still see it, but you know, you can't. It's not exactly the same. It looks better with the light. <laughs> okay, Judy. Okay, no, Judy, it is on clearance. Um, it has been on clearance for a long time. Um, it's, I, th I don't quote me, but I'm pretty sure it's been on clearance the whole time I've been a consultant, so over a year. But it is an awesome warmer. It is one of my favorites. Hey, Heather. Hey, girl. So, it, I, I love it. it. Like I said, it's one of my favorites. Um, And going back to the safety thing, guys, I leave all of these on 24-7. I don't ever turn them off. That's the first time I turn that warmer off in I don't know how long. I leave all of, excuse my mess, but I leave all of these warmers on. And see how most of these, every single one of these in here except for that one is an element warmer. Or, I mean, excuse me, a light bulb warmer. See, there's a light bulb one. This one has a light bulb. Both of these are light bulb warmers. That's a diffuser. Oh, this one's element warmer too, but just so happens that this one also has a light because it's called by the candlelight, so it's like a little flicker. Yes, you did make it when I was live, actually. I, t I feel like I tag you all the time. Lockdown sucks. So, actually, it's going to be going for longer. Tr I heard that Trump, like, said that we're going to be extending social distancing until April 30th, so a whole nother month. So get used to it, girl. We, we all need to hunker down and be prepared. All right, well, that is my product of the day review. Um, so if you guys have any questions about that warmer or anything else, just let me know. I'll stay on for just a couple more minutes and see if you guys have any questions, if there's anything you want to talk about. Um, I'm stuck in my house too. Yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy, girl. I feel I thought I did tag you, so I'm glad I'm glad I did. But I like can't remember. I'm like, oh wait. I know a lot of you asked me to tag you, and I sometimes I forget. I try to remember, so if I don't tag you, I'm sorry. No um, special thing, girl. I have to go back to work tomorrow, so. I've been off of work for two weeks. They, Ashlyn had a rash three Fridays ago, and so they didn't let me go to work for two weeks um, because she had a rash. So tomorrow, I have to go back to work tomorrow. Yay, fun. <laughs> but I don't know, I'm kind of glad because um, these kids are making me crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Yeah, yeah. Girl, you need to send me some Taco Bell. Taco Bell is my legit favorite. I haven't had Taco Bell in so long. I've been like dreaming of Taco Bell because I'm like, oh, fast food. Okay, who who cook, who, I know we're getting off topic, it's not sensey, but who cooks a lot? Like, I, let me just give you a lowdown. My mom worked 80 hours a week at Burger King when I was growing up. So guess what I ate every night 
for dinner. Burger King. I mean, not every single night, but a good majority of the nights. I mean, when you're when you have a single, when you have a single mom with two kids, eight working eighty hours a week, sixty to eighty hours a week, trying to make it work. You know, you got to do what you got to do. I spent pretty much my first like half of my life at Burger King, sitting in either the break room or my mom's office because she was a manager, or just in the lobby. So I eat Burger King all the time. I'm a fast food junkie. I love fast food. I hate cooking mostly because I hate cleaning up, but you know, well, we won't go there, but I, I hate it. I, I do not like to cook. I love fast food. I eat fast food all the time. It's not very healthy, I know, but it's good. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just a fast food junkie and I'm like, I have not had any in like two weeks. I'm like dying. I'm like, I do not want to cook a single meal for you guys anymore. You guys can make your own meals. <laughs> Bur okay. Burger King did get really nasty for a while, but they're making a comeback, I think, personally. I personally think they're making a comeback. I don't know. I also think it depends on the location. That's a, like a, a key thing, you guys. Um, don't try not to diss something from just for, like like for instance, maybe you tr maybe you've heard of Sensi before, before me, of course. Um, but maybe that consultant, in your opinion, wasn't a great consultant. Well, you can't just diss the whole company, right? So maybe you just have to find a better consultant, like they connect with, like me. So Burger you have to find, or any any place, you have to find a good location, A. But yes, I agree. Like, they did go way downhill. But they are coming back up. <laughs> so, yeah, I, I'm not, I'm not, I'm, there's one right by my house that I actually go to a lot because it's right between my house and school. So I do go there, like, quite a bit because I just, like, go from school, so. But, you know, Taco Bell, I love Taco Bell. Taco Bell is my all-time favorite. I love Taco Bell. I could go, I could eat Taco Bell every single day. If there's a fast food place you guys could eat every day, what would it be? Let me know. So, all right, guys. Do you guys have any other questions about the warmer of the day? Let me show you, or excuse me, the product of the day, which is a warmer. I will be doing more warmers. I just want to, like, kind of showcase um, them you know, individually. This is my favorite that I have. I, I say that a lot. I say I have a lot of favorite things, but this, I just love it so much. A, because I customized it to make it what I wanted. You know, it has a picture of me and my um, family in there. And then it also has, you know, a little memorabilia of Ashley being born. So to me, that's super sweet. I love that. And I love the idea of being able to like decorate it. I think I'm going to get another one so I can leave this one like this. It'd be perfect for like a memorial or even like how I have this here with new baby, you know, anything like that. So if you know, maybe a mom that's going to have a baby soon, maybe it'd be a good baby shower gift for them so they can put it in the baby's room and use it as a nightlight and just put maybe their baby stuff in there because I have a nightlight for my daughter. So, okay, so... I'm sure working there makes it better. I mean, worse. I'm sure making working working there makes it worse. Hey, Vashon. Um, yeah, let me know. Yes, I can definitely make you a special box for your birthday. So thank you for mentioning that. Um, so if anyone. I do these um, boxes right now, like I'm, as you've seen me post them, but if there is a special occasion that you guys want, like wedding, um, birthday, anniversary, baby shower, anything like that, I can totally make you something. I made my cousin, I'm going to have to see if he has a picture of it. I made my cousin for Christmas, um, for his boss, I made him a whole like gift basket to give to his boss. I And it, not only Scentsy products did I include, I included like he want. I included some cleaning products, so I bought her some kitchen towels and I included um, a bottle of the all-purpose um, cleaner that you have to dilute so I included like a spray bottle so she could dilute it and she really likes a farmhouse theme so I went to Hobby Lobby and I got a little like cute farmhouse plaque so I, I also do add those other other things in there so oh I keep freezing I think this has bad service in here so anyways, if you guys need a box, let me know. I can make any type of box for you. And um, maybe not any type, but I can, I'm sure I can come up with something. So, all right, well, I'll, I'll keep in mind that your birthday is in June, June 22nd. Okay, so cleaning, po I know you love sunflowers and there's a perfect scent for that. Starbucks. <laughs> okay, well, let me, um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll talk about it some more for sure. 
So I will go ahead and get off of here for tonight. Thank you guys for joining my product of the day review. I will see you guys tomorrow. If there is a product that you would like to know more about that you want me to do a re review on, let me know and I will do it. We Like I said, we've already done the Scentsy Soak. This was day one. You can, I've also saved and uploaded the videos and I'm uploading them on my YouTube channel. So if you want to go back and watch later, you can. Day one was Scentsy Soak. Day two was the Scentsy Fresh. Um, I actually put it back in my living room, so I don't have it right here in my hands to show you, but you can definitely go back and watch the video, or if you have any questions, just let me know. All right, I will talk to you guys soon. Have a great night. Bye.